Peter Panda. Hello! Come on, let's go and have some fun today. <laughs> Hi, Dr. Panda. What are you going to do today? Oh, hey, look at the cool uniform I'm wearing. Can you guess what job I'm doing today? Fire You're a firefighter. Fighter. That's right. Cool, huh? <laughs> oh, hey, Toto. <laughs> Fire! That's right, Toto. Firefighters put out fires. But we can also help when someone gets stuck. That's why I bring this axe. Dr. Panda, come down here. Coming, Olette. Ready? Here we go. <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> uh, hi, Olette. What's up? Hi, Dr. Panda. It's time for the ladder test. <gasps> we have to make sure it works properly for when there's an emergency. Okay, you get up the ladder and I'll operate the panel. No, you're Chief Ladder Firefighter. I'm Supervisor of Operations. Oh, what does that mean? It means you get up the ladder and I operate it. But you don't know which lever operates what. I'll work it out. Get up there. Okay. Hmm, now let me see. Uh, <coughs> ah, ah, no! The green one! Oops, sorry. Ah, oh! hmm, I wonder what the yellow one is for. <coughs> ah, 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 right. What are you doing? Stop it! <laughs> okay, okay. Let me see. Ah, 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 wasn't it? Um, <laughs> wait, I got it now! Uh, uh, oh. Yep, the ladder works perfectly. Uh, we can check that off the list. I feel dizzy. Let's test the siren next. Yeah, hello? Hoopa, are you there? Dr. Panda, you have to help me. It's an emergency. I'm stuck. I can hardly see you, Hoopa. Where are you? I'm at home. I'm stuck inside my own house. Please come. Hang on, buddy. We're on our way. But we didn't test the siren yet. We'll do it on the way. Are you coming, Toto? Yay! Nina, Nina, Nina! Can you tell us what happened, Hooper? I was building an extra tower on my house, but I forgot to make a door. Or any windows. It's really dark in here. No worries. We'll get you out. Hold on, Hoopa. I'm coming. I'll let the ladder. Ready? Ready. <laughs> <laughs> Easy. Whoa! A lot! Oh, whoops! Sorry! Hoopa! Are you in there? Hang on, I have a visitor. Come on in! Oh, wait, there's no door. Step back, Hoopa! I have to break the wall with my axe! <laughs> Dr. Panda! Am I glad to see you! Whoa! Cool ladder! Thanks, guys! It was really dark up there. Moo? What's the trouble? It's an emergency! No worries! We're on our way! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! no. Oh no! What's the emergency? Oh! Oh! It's Bella, one of my chickens. She went all the way up this tree, and now she's afraid to come back down. Have you tried calling for her? Oh. Bella! <laughs> She can't hear me. Have you tried tempting her down with some food? Oh. Yoo-hoo! Bella! Look what I got here. A basket full of cupcakes. Mmm. Oh, mm. oh, so good. Hmm. That doesn't seem to work either. OK, that's it. We have to chop the tree down. There's no other way. Wait! Halt! Stop! There is another way. Yes! Good idea. We can knock the tree over with the truck. Or we could use the ladder. Oh, right. Ready? Uh-huh. 
Slow and steady now. Hey there, Bella. No need to be afraid. You want to come down with me? Oh. Wow. Huh. You don't want to leave, do you? You want to enjoy the view. <laughs> Dr. Pander, where's my chicken? She doesn't want to come down. Oh, no. Oh, no. That means this picnic is ruined. Hang on. Is that why you need her down? Yes. I've prepared this wonderful picnic for all of us. But we can't eat it while she's up there. Hey, you know, ladders aren't just for getting someone down. They can also take someone up. Hmm? Hi. Mind if we join you? Oh. oh. Come on up, everyone. Wow. What a beautiful sunset. It sure is. Hey, good work on operating that ladder. Thanks, Dr. Panda. Ah, I think that was another job well done, Toto. <laughs> awesome! Yeah, yeah. You know, that ladder was actually a lot of fun. <gasps> hey, maybe we can make a ride out of it and start a carnival. What do you think? Yay! Well, that'll be an adventure for another day. See you next time. Goodbye, Goodbye, Dr. Panda. Bye-bye. <laughs> what are you going to do today? Oh, I know. You're a police officer. <laughs> Almost. Today, I'm a traffic director. Oh, that sounds very important. Yep, it is important. Traffic directors make sure cars, trucks, and people drive safely along the road. Yay! And here's something to help me. <whistles> oh, hi, Toto. Do you want to practice the special traffic signals with me? Okay, let's see. Ahem. Stop, listen, look, and go. <laughs> awesome. Oh, and now it's time for us to go. Hey, Toto, do you remember the special traffic signals? Stop. Stop. Listen, Listen. Look. Yeah. Go. Go. Hey, watch this. Huh? Yay. Wow. Whoa. See you guys. Bye, Bib. Your turn, Hoopa. I'll see you on the way back. I'm just off to pick up some bricks. Great. See you later. Uh-oh. I tell you what's going on. My chickens are everywhere. That's what's going on. Moo! Uh, I think we have a bit of a problem here. Moo! My poor chickens! This is terrible, Dr. Panda. You'll have to help me round them up. I'm happy to help, Moo, but someone needs to look after the crossing. Oh, I can take care of that. Thanks, May, May, but you don't know the special traffic signals. You can teach me. How hard can it be? Hurry, Dr. Panda! We need to get my chickens back! Okay, here we go. You need to use stop, listen, look, and go. I've got it. Come on, Dr. Panda! My chickens won't catch themselves! Are you sure you'll be all right, May May? Toto will stay here with you to help. He knows the special traffic signals, too. Yep, don't worry. I'll be fine. Dr. Panda! Don't forget those signals! Let's see, what was stop? I remember stop, listen, look, and go. Perfect! Now a bit faster. Stop, listen, look, and go. Stop, listen, look, and go. <laughs> it's almost like a dance. <gasps> hey, that's an idea! A
What is she doing? A am I supposed to go or, or stop? Go! I don't know. What's going on here? That doesn't look like what Dr. Panda was doing. Go! No, wait, stop! Of the moo. I need to get back to being a traffic director. Whoa, a traffic jam! And a great big mess! How will we ever fix this? Oh. I dropped my load. I'm sorry, Dr. Panda. I don't know how this happened. I do. May May made all the wrong moves. Instead of this, she did this. No, no, no. It was more like this. No, that's nothing like it. It was like this. You mean like this? Uh, no, I think it was more like this. Oh, I see. So you turned directing traffic into a dance. Mm hmm. Sorry. I guess I got carried away. And you made Hooper spill all his bricks. It's going to take ages to sort this out. Not if we all help. And I know exactly how to speed things up. May May, you're going to have to teach us how to do your dance properly. <laughs> Ready, everyone? A one, two, three, four. Panda. No, thank you. That was fun, wasn't it, Toto? <laughs> yeah. I guess it's time for me to go too. <laughs> Bye, May May. Wow, Toto, that's an awesome move. You'd like to do more dancing? <laughs> yeah. Well, that's an adventure for another day. See you next time, everyone. Goodbye, Goodbye Dr. Panda. <laughs> Hi, Dr. Panda. What are you going to do today? Dr. Panda? Hello? Dr. Dr. Panda. Panda? Where could he be? <laughs> coming! Coming! I'm here! Hi, everyone. Whew. Can you guess what job I'm doing today? <laughs> You're a mailman! That's right! Today, I'm... The first rule of being a mailman is never be late. Oh, hi, Richie. You're right. I'm sorry. My alarm clock is broken and it didn't wake me up. Why didn't you order a new one? I did. And it was supposed to come in the mail a week ago, but it still hasn't been delivered. Well, okay. Let's get to work. I have all this mail to sort and you have to make your round. As long as nothing else goes wrong today, we should be a-okay. Uh-oh. <gasps> This is really bad. What's the matter? This package has been stuck in the machine, and now it's been labeled with every address. And these packages didn't get labeled at all. So how will we ever know who this mail is for? You have to deliver these packages today. The important thing is not to panic. Too late for that. I'm already panicking. What do we do? Hmm. Well, we have all the addresses, so we know who is expecting deliveries. Now we just have to work out which package belongs to whom. Maybe we can open the mail to see if there are any clues inside. No! The second rule of being a mailman is never, ever open the packages yourself. Ah, uh, okay, okay. Um, hmm. Let's see what we know. It says on here that this package came from Baboon Building Supplies. Aha! So who do we know in Panda City that likes to build things? I think I know who ordered this package. Oh, oh boy. Oh, hi, 
Hey, guys. Hey, Hoopa. Did you order something from Baboon Building Supplies? My bricks. <laughs> Let me help you. Yay! Is it okay if I take this? Sure, no problem. Thanks, Dr. Panda. What a great service. <gasps> Look, Toto. Moo's name is on one of the labels. She must have ordered something. Let's go. <laughs> Moo! Moo who? Are you home? I have this package for you, but I don't know which. <laughs> hey, chickens! Hey, chickens! <laughs> <laughs> they can smell the food I ordered for them. Ah, so that's why they were chasing me. Maybe we can use the chicken's excellent sense of smell to work out which package is yours. <laughs> this must be the one. <laughs> Corn, their favorite. Great job, guys. Oh, glad to help. Okay, Toto, only three more packages to go. And look, one of these is for Olette. Hello, Dr. Panda. Do you have my package? I'm sure I do, but I don't know which one it is. Something went wrong at the sorting office and some packages weren't labeled correctly. Oh, no. I have to practice for my basketball game, but I can't do that without the ball I ordered. Oh, <laughs> I think I know which one is your package. Oh, this one. No, uh... Don't you think the ball is in the round package? Oh, not the square one. No, not the square one. <laughs> my ball! Great! Do you want to stay for a game? Oh, maybe later. We still have two more packages to deliver. One of them is for May May. Hi, Dr. Panda. Oh, what have you got for me? Hi, May May. One of these is yours, but I don't know which one. Do you remember what you ordered? Oh, Dr. Panda, it could be anything. A new dress, a nice warm sweater, a scarf. Whatever's in this package is hard. It feels wooden. This feels much softer. Oh, and all the things you mentioned are soft as well. Yes, you're right. I guess this must be your package then. Oh, wow, my coat. Isn't it beautiful? <laughs> <laughs> it looks great on you. Thanks, Dr. Panda. Well, that just leaves this package. But I can't read the last label. Hmm. Maybe if I carefully peel off the other address label, I can find out who this last package is for. Oh, oh no! I ripped it! <gasps> what will you do? Uh, I guess we'll have to take it back to Richie and tell him the bad news. Dr. Panda, did you manage to deliver all the packages? Uh, all except one. I accidentally ripped the last label. What? That means we'll never have it delivered on time. <gasps> Tick tock. What is it, Toto? Tick tock. Of course. I know who this is for. Hey, what are you doing? Remember the second rule. Never open the mail yourself. <laughs> but this final package is for me. It's the new alarm clock you ordered. That's right. Well, Let's hope it wakes you up in time for your next job. We'll have to find out about that another day. See you next time. Goodbye, Goodbye Dr. Dr. Panda. Panda. <laughs>